Testing, testing. One, two, three. What's up, guys? Bill here again. I'm going to do a uh, spray paint art tutorial on this black and white spray paint. So, I'm going to try my best to explain this, how I do this, and how I'm going to um, try my hardest to explain different. Uh, different techniques you can learn and stuff. As you can tell, as you as you as you can tell, <laughs> I got all my pen and stencils set out and everything. So I'm just gonna mark them using black. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna show you a cool thing at the end of this video: how to uh, make starburst coming out without getting any. Uh, of this when you push it down and get dots. I came up with a cool idea, so hope you hope you guys like this video. First down first I'm gonna spray a little black on this side. And on and over here. <coughs> using the paint I'm using is color place spray paint, Walmart brand. I'm gonna wrinkle this up like this. Have, <coughs> have a texture. Lay hand across it. Pull up. There's your first texture. Same with this one. Fill up. That's all you gotta do. Alright, try and do that again. Yep, there we go. And I'm gonna try to do a little more paint on over here. And just plant it, make this planet a, a little lighter. So. Uh, I want to say thank you to all the people who uh, supported me through um, on Facebook with uh, spray paint art on one of my paintings, spray paintings that I did was a forest. Anyway, I just, I just want to say thank you for that. Put a little black right here, right here. It was a uh, forbidden forest, and I want to thank everybody for that because you guys really liked that one. I'm still getting likes on it. But anyway, back to the space painting. Press down, slide back. Press down, slide back. Okay. All, all you need really is one magazine sheet for this. I mean, you don't need like a bunch. I'm just going to take my core of my hand, hit in the uh, side of my hand, and just go like this. Make a texture. There we go. See that? Just one, using one magazine sheet. Okay, here's the black. Now, where the light goes, Shane's going to be on the other side. So, the light's going to be here. The, the, the shadow's going to be over here on the other side. So. Right here. Now, I'm going to put a planet in this planet. Let me get another stencil, another uh, plant stencil, like this, which is just a cap, a little cap I use. Put that right there. And the way you do this, spray around like this, like dab it. Make sure you go all the way around. There. Okay, cool, cool. Okay, now we're gonna do the, sh the light. So here, here's the almost so like this. I'm running out white, it happens. I'm gonna make another trip back to Walmart or the Dollar Tree. And then quick quick over later. Okay, now well that planet is inside this planet, I'm gonna let that dry so nothing messes up. So I'm gonna put these planet stencils back on the other planets that we just made. I think that one that was there. This was there. This one was right here. And make sure you get the black and the white in there, so you have the contrast of the colors in it. It did the just pans I've got, I've got from thrift, thrift stores, so. Alright, now, here comes the cool part. Here's a technique I'm going to show you guys that I recently just thought of, and not discovered, thought of. Instead of making, like, big splashes and leaving gaps on these spray cans, because you leave marks on your paintings. Uh, you can do something really cool. 
with it. I guess I'll show you. Well, you guys try this technique out and uh, let me know how this comes out. I just want to really thank everybody for help, not helping me, but supporting me with my art, spray paintings and stuff. Now, as you see, I'm not just holding the can going, like, I'm, I'm really just doing this, just like, little strokes. Okay, I think that's good enough. So the, some of the paint is being through, which I knew that happened, but... Let me try to get this even. Okay, there we go. Now the thing I was going to tell you guys, when you put this upside down, it won't leave any marks on the black paint. So this here's a cool idea for you. Watch this. So you keep it in a circular motion. Okay, so see, there was no black balance, so now I can just do this. Spray white on top of that. So now, see what I'm saying? That was an idea I thought of in my, in my, in my mind. And now, it's uh, pretty much done. And one thing I've got to do is the stars. So the way you do the star technique, you can spray on your finger, which is this. Flick once and add the stars which I'm used to sp you know, spray paint my hands I've got to get some gloves but that ain't no biggie that ain't no biggie just comes right off I'm having a star filled day so you guys gotta bear with me on this now another thing you can do you can spray the outside of the planet by doing that to give it a more realistic look this one too. But you don't want to go behind the lid because you want to stay in front of the lid. That's where the light's hitting it. Okay, then let's lift these up. Let's see what we see what we made. There's planet number one, planet number two, planet number three, planet number four, plus a small planet we put inside the big planet. And there's planet number five, which you can see because I didn't shadow it. And also, also looks like there's a light coming. So yeah. Um, this is a pretty basic tutorial, guys. One thing I do re recommend you do is sign your painting before it is finished. So I'm gonna sign it. Oh, sorry. Sorry about the camera movement. <laughs> I'm gonna sign it right here on the left side of it. So here's this. Billy. Let me get a clear cut so I can. Get the paint. We wet the paint. Always catch your magazine sheet before it hits the painting. <laughs> Billy K, which is Cassander, my last name. 2014. And. This was a very simple tutorial, guys. Um, I thought the idea with the, the gashes coming out like this. See you. That leave any marks. Like, I thought it would be pretty cool to do. This, this is just a simple tutorial. I uh, hope you guys like it. But here's the finished product. Let me get show it to the camera. And the canvas I'm using is poster board, which is the paper I use. So don't freak out. It ain't canvas, it's poster board. See, there's the, there's the planets. Some of the shadowing wasn't too good on the big planet, but stuff happens. But that's that's about it. Thank you for watching. And uh, I thought, hope you guys try that, that uh, sh shining burst technique. Because that will, that will uh, be easier on you without smearing the black paint. Thank you. This has been Billy. God bless and peace.